Tour leaders of the Rakan KL Merdeka Walk, Jalan Pudu, were Adrian and Pauline. Meeting point that morning was a garden pharmacy at the corner of Jalan Sultan. Garden pharmacy now occupies what used to be a kopitiam, famous for its homemade ice cream. Built in 1956, two more stories were added to it later. The group headed towards Puduraya. There used to be an old train line that ran behind Puduraya towards Central Market. Opposite is Menare May Bank, once the tallest building in Malaysia. Outside Puduraya is one of the famous 40,000 ringgit public toilets. As expected, it was not functioning. Then over the pedestrian bridge, down Jalan Pudu and up some stairs to Kapal Singh's office. Opposite his office is a view of the abandoned Plaza Rakyat. Around KL City, new developments are underway. A few minutes walk away is Tung Shin Hospital. This is the old hospital building built by Kapitan Yap Kwan Seng. It still uses traditional Chinese medicine to treat patients today, but it also has a modern medicine division. Opposite Tung Shin Hospital is St. Anthony Church at Jalan Robertson. This church is over 100 years old. It has not changed much. Kapitan Yap Kwan Seng is the only Chinese to have not one but three streets named in his honour. This street is named after his company. San Zhao Ke, that means new something game. <laughs> there is nothing much to see of the old Pudu jail which used to hold Botat Chin. This is what it is today. Only its Pintu Gerbang is left standing. It will be a matter of time before that is knocked down too. The tour ended at a hipster cafe.